Hi, my name is Jessica Wilbur, and I am a regional recruiting manager with ABS Kids, currently living just outside of Kalamazoo, Michigan. A child can typically be diagnosed as early as two years old, and it really is important to get that as soon as you possibly can. Um, while you are able to get certain services like speech therapy and things of that nature just based off of pediatrician recommendation, the full autism diagnosis really opens a lot of options for what you can really do to get support for your child, whether that be ABA therapy or other services within the school system, that type of thing. So getting that official diagnosis really is paramount to being able to get everything that you need to support your child. Every child has different triggers or sensory sensitivities, so it really just depends on the needs of your child. My, when my 11-year-old was diagnosed at two, we did basically every service that was available. He was in ABA therapy for about two years. He's done speech therapy. He's done occupational therapy. And even now in fifth grade, he still has speech therapy through the school system. So it really just depends on the needs of your particular child and what they respond to. And always remember that if you try something and it doesn't work, it's okay to cancel it. So, um, you know, give it a chance and see how it works out. And then you can always try something different. There's so many organizations out there set up just to help families, um, children, their parents, their caregivers through any processes or any roadblocks that they may have. So you may have to do a little research or a little Googling to find a place in your area. For example, here in Kalamazoo, Michigan, we have an organization called the Integrated Services of Kalamazoo, and they really help you find a good path for your child, whether that be ABA therapy or um, certain programs, schools, certain programs outside of school, um, speech therapies, occupational therapies, they really will sit down with you and, and go through what the needs of your child are and how you can get assistance. And they, they really just know for this area specifically, they know what's available, what, um, struggles you can have when it comes to insurances and things of that nature and are really able to give you some great advice and and put you in the right direction if you need assistance with those things. I have two sons with autism. One is seven, one is 11, and they are both full-time in school with neurotypical children. And so they, they're in an environment that is not necessarily built for them. But I have found that our particular school system at least is very good. Um, the teachers and the staff are very good at really including them in everything and helping the other children within the classroom understand what their differences are, what their sensory sensitivities are, that type of thing, and really um, encouraging the children within the gen ed classroom to help support their classmates, specifically my my kids. That's been my experience that the other kids within the classrooms are, are really jumping in to help them when they need help. And I think it just, it starts at the beginning, whether that be the schools or the parents um, as a parent, whether you have a child with autism or not, just teaching your child about the differences um, of people with Within the world and that that we should be kind ultimately that we we should just really be kind and and helpful to others in the nine years since my oldest son was diagnosed i have really been able to experience autism on so many different levels through my own children as well as other parents and and kids that i have met over the years and what I have found ultimately is they all have strengths and challenges just like any other person does. And they're, at least for my kids, is a very unique worldview that they have. And I have really 
loved being able to experience that worldview and see how they see things differently and really um, learning how their mind functions differently than mine does. It, it truly has been an excellent experience being able to see that and, and have a different view of the world. And so I, I love that and hope that other people are, are open to, to seeing that if they have the opportunity to engage with other individuals within the autism community. Thank you so much for watching.